Hello curious minds, did you know that our entire galaxy along with millions of others, is being pulled towards something unseen? What is this mysterious force and where is it taking us? Let's try to find out. Imagine this. You're on a spaceship, moving at over 600 kilometers per second but you have no idea what's pulling you. That's exactly what's happening to our Milky Way galaxy right now. We are being drawn towards something incredibly massive, but we can't even see it. This mysterious force is called the Great Attractor, and it lies about 250 million light years away in a region of space known as the Laniakea Supercluster, a vast collection of galaxies including our own. Scientists believe that the Great Attractor is a gravitational anomaly, meaning it has so much mass that it's pulling galaxies toward it at astonishing speeds. But here's the problem. We can't see it directly. The Great Attractor is hidden behind the dense, star-filled heart of our galaxy, in a region called the Zone of Avoidance, a part of the sky that's obscured by thick cosmic dust and gas. So if we can't see it, how do we know it's there? Scientists first suspected its existence when they noticed that the Milky Way and thousands of nearby galaxies weren't just expanding outward with the universe. Instead they had an extra motion, being pulled toward a specific point in space. This unexpected movement meant that something incredibly massive must be exerting an enormous gravitational force. But what exactly is it? A supercluster of galaxies? A vast region filled with dark matter? Or could it be something even stranger? It's like trying to figure out what's at the center of a hurricane while being tossed around in one of its outer bands. So how do astronomers study something they can't even see? Let's dive deeper and explore the scientific tools and techniques. If the Great Attractor is hidden behind the dense core of our galaxy, how do we even know it exists? Well it's a bit like knowing a celebrity is at a party because you see the paparazzi swarming around a particular area. Astronomers first noticed something strange when they studied the motion of nearby galaxies. According to the cosmic expansion theory galaxies should be spreading apart as the universe expands, but instead, our Milky Way and thousands of other galaxies are moving toward a specific region of space at over 600 kilometers per second. This unexplained motion hinted that something massive was pulling them in. So, if visible light is blocked, what can we use? That's where different types of observations come in. Unlike visible light, radio waves can pass through the thick clouds of gas and dust in the Milky Way. Instruments like NASA's Spitzer Telescope and WISE have helped map hidden galaxies beyond the zone of avoidance. But that wasn't enough. To truly understand what's there, astronomers turned to X-ray telescopes like NASA's Chandra X-ray Observatory and ESA's XMM-Newton. These powerful instruments revealed massive clusters of galaxies packed with hot gas glowing in X-rays, suggesting the presence of something even bigger lurking in the background. Through gravitational lensing, scientists can study how massive objects like galaxy clusters bend and distort light from galaxies behind them. By analyzing these distortions, astronomers can infer the presence of unseen mass, which could be connected to the Great Attractor. Through peculiar velocity studies, astronomers track how galaxies move in relation to the general expansion of the universe. By studying their peculiar velocity, which is caused by gravitational forces like the pull of the Great Attractor, scientists can pinpoint where this mysterious force is located. Through gamma-ray and high-energy studies, researchers use telescopes like the Fermi Gamma-ray Space Telescope to look for signs of dark matter or other high-energy phenomena. These studies help uncover indirect clues about the Great Attractor's composition and its effects on nearby galaxies. Even with these tools the mystery isn't fully solved. Now that we know how astronomers are detecting the Great Attractor, let's dive into the theories surrounding this cosmic enigma. After all, if we can't see it directly, what exactly is it? One of the leading ideas is that it's a supermassive galaxy cluster, a dense concentration of galaxies bound together by gravity. It could be a massive galaxy supercluster much like our own Laniakea supercluster but located farther out. This theory suggests that the Great Attractor could be pulling galaxies toward it with an immense gravitational force, like a giant cosmic magnet. But there's a twist. Some scientists think that it's not just a single supercluster but a region filled with dark matter. Dark matter doesn't emit light or energy, which makes it hard to detect directly, but its gravitational effects are very real. If the Great Attractor is a dark matter-dominated region, it would explain the strange pull we're feeling. However, the mystery deepens when we consider the Shapley Supercluster, another massive group of galaxies. This supercluster is located roughly 650 million light-years away, and some astronomers believe that it could be the real source of the gravitational pull we're detecting. Could the Great Attractor just be the tip of the iceberg, with the Shapley Supercluster lurking behind it, creating a massive gravitational well? Then there's the possibility that this pull is part of an even larger scale structure, a kind of cosmic web connecting galaxy superclusters. 
Some researchers suggest that the Great Attractor is simply one part of a vast cosmic structure that includes not only Shapley but also other superclusters farther out. If this is the case, the pull we're feeling might be just a small part of an even bigger force. And here's the wildest theory. What if the Great Attractor is not just pulling galaxies in a regular gravitational way but instead is somehow linked to dark energy? Dark energy is the mysterious force driving the accelerated expansion of the universe. Could the Great Attractor be at the center of a cosmic, dark energy bubble, altering the motion of galaxies on a vast scale? As we search for answers, it's clear that the Great Attractor remains a puzzle, one that could change our understanding of the universe. So, what does the Great Attractor mean for our galaxy? Are we on a collision course with this cosmic behemoth? Should we be worried about being sucked into some unseen force? Well, the good news is that while the Great Attractor is definitely pulling on us, it's not about to swallow us up anytime soon. The pull of it is incredibly slow. In fact, it's been affecting us for billions of years, and we're only moving toward it at about 600 kilometers per second. It's not nearly enough to make an immediate impact. However, this slow but steady motion suggests something important about the future of our galaxy. The Great Attractor's gravitational force is influencing the motion of the Milky Way and the galaxies around us. Meaning that our galactic journey isn't just about the expansion of the universe, it's about being pulled toward this massive, unseen force. But here's the interesting part. What happens when the Milky Way reaches the Great Attractor? The truth is, we might never actually reach it. Some scientists think the Great Attractor could just be a gravity well, an invisible point of intense mass that draws things closer, but doesn't necessarily result in an actual collision. Instead, we might pass by it, continuing our journey through the universe, influenced but not captured. Another possibility is that our galaxy could eventually merge with other nearby galaxies as we move toward the Great Attractor. One thing is for certain, the future of the Milky Way and its place in the cosmos is far from settled. As we continue to explore the universe and develop new technologies, we'll undoubtedly gain a deeper understanding of the Great Attractor and the mysteries it holds. New telescopes will allow us to peer through the gas and dust that obscures our view, giving us a clearer picture of this enigmatic region of space. We'll be able to study the motions of galaxies in even greater detail, map out the distribution of dark matter with greater precision, and perhaps even uncover new clues about the nature of gravity itself. The Great Attractor is not just a mystery, it's a laboratory, a place where we can test our theories about the universe and push the boundaries of human knowledge, and who knows what we might find. Perhaps we'll discover new types of celestial objects, uncover hidden connections between seemingly disparate cosmic phenomena, or even rewrite our understanding of the universe's origins and evolution. The more we learn, the more we realize how much more there is to discover. And there you have it. The Great Attractor remains one of the biggest cosmic mysteries pulling our galaxy toward it with an immense unseen force. But is it the ultimate destination or could something even larger be shaping our universe? What do you think? Could there be an even bigger force out there? Let us know in the comments, and if you enjoyed this journey through the cosmos, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you never miss our next space adventure. Thanks for watching, until next time keep looking up. Eep.